Hey everyone, it's Shaper1000 here. Like the title says, we're going to be giving away this hammock. And um, I'm going to tell you how to win it here in just a second. Stick around, cue the intro. Let's get into this. Okay guys, so here's what we're going to do. We're going to give away my old hammock. Um, I've had it for a couple years. This thing is in flawless condition. Um, it's never been, you know, there shouldn't be any burn holes in it. There shouldn't be any holes in the netting. Um, I have used this many times and I've never had an issue with it. Now I'm going to tell you what you're going to get if you win this. I'm going to tell you how to win it here in just a minute. <clears throat> this is your hammock. This is what you're going to win. Okay? This has a built-in bug net. You don't have to use the bug net. Okay? So the bug net, um, you just flip your hammock over. and You don't need to use the bug net if you just want to use it for a hammock. Or if you don't want to sleep with the bug net on. You don't have to. It's not removable but you can just flip it over. It works both ways. Um, so this is the hammock. You're going to get the hammock itself. Now this hammock, this bag, is built right onto the hammock. So when you unroll it, the bag stays on it, so don't try to pull it off because it won't come off. You'll rip it. <laughs> it's built onto it, and I like that. So you don't have to worry about losing the bag. Um, and then after you tear down, you just stuff it in your bag as you're tearing it down, and it comes in this this bag right here so I like that idea um, like I said that way you don't lose your bag and then also the uh, the bag that you know this bag it'll you know it'll be there on the side and you can put stuff in it your water bottle your phone small camera whatever to, to store in it while your hammock is set up you are going to get the tarp that goes with it uh, this is a tarp. Uh, it's not actually a rain flat. It's not built onto it, of course. It's a tarp. You don't need to use it. In fact, I think the first time I used it, I didn't have the tarp on it. Um, I used it a couple years ago on one of my annual solos. And it's um, fairly easy to set up. Uh, I've never had an issue with this. I've never had leaking uh, I've had it out in the rain. Like I said, I've used it many times. I've, it's never leaked. So that's good. Um, I've never had a problem with the wind blowing uh, water in. Uh, I've had it set up out back here. There's two different ways you can set this tarp up. You can set it up. They want you to set it up in a diagonal diamond pattern, which I had it set up that way the last time. But uh, a couple other times I used it, I just used it as just like a tent style. Okay, so, but yeah, that's um, this tarp. When you get this tarp out, there'll be a seam running kind of down one side of it um, where it's sewn together. Now this, this seam, it feels a little sticky or tacky. That is, is waterproofing I put on it. Just um, petroleum jelly or... Uh, Vaseline I use I seal all my tents that way I always seal wherever there's a there's a seam that that is open to water I always seal them and and that's what that is so don't be alarmed don't say oh what is this you know what he sent me it's just Vaseline this thing is clean it's fine that's just uh, that's what I use for my water sealer um, like I said this thing does not leak um, this did not come with it, but I'm going to give you, there's about three, three and a half feet of paracord here. It's not 550, but it is a good thick paracord um, just for extra in case you need to tie something out or cut this up and use it to tie other things. It's always good to have extra, and I, I think I used it the last time when I had it set up out back here uh, in the hut that we're building. Um, I think I used it then to get over some trees or some weeds or something anyway. So I'm going to throw this in for you because it's always good to have a little extra. You're going to get your straps. These are one inch straps. Uh, I'm not sure how long they are. They're, they're pretty long. 
Um, you wrap around the tree, put one end through this loop and pull it and then it's got several other loops that you can attach to to adjust your hammock. He can do uh, the daisy chain, daisy chain I believe it's called. Um, this is 500 pounds. I think once the tent is set up, I believe it will hold it was either 380 or 400 pounds. It's it's very strong. Um, I'm like 198 right now. I've never had an issue with it. Um, they say I think it was 400 pounds. And in this little baggie here, as you noticed, all the bags match. Uh, you are going to get. It out of here they send you these are your guidelines for your tarp it's got these on it on one end to adjust adjustments and then on the other end you just um, wherever it's at but the other end you just tie off onto your corners of your tarp and then you can adjust it out they give you two I found an extra one. I'm going to give you an extra one. It's always good to have extra. And if you have to, you can use this. Um, also, they give you they give you two two pegs. I'm going to give you four. I've always got extra. Um, these are the the smaller ones. There. This is a cheap tank, uh, cheap hammock, guys. It's you know not a real expensive one. I think I gave thirty bucks for it a couple years ago. I don't know. I'll have to see if I can find it. If I can, I'll put the price across here. Um, but I did. I can't remember if I did a review on this tent or on this hammock or not. But so I'm going to give you four of these pegs. Here's the two it came with. <coughs> Excuse me. They're fine, but they're not as shiny as these. See the difference? So I'm going to give you four brand new ones. I always carry extra tent pegs. <coughs> like I said, um, and I think one of my last videos, I, I, uh, I'm, I'm in Florida, so we're, we're a peninsula. We're mostly sand. These don't do real well in the sand because they're kind of small, you know. But what these are good for is uh, like the solid hard ground. Uh, if it's cold out and the ground's real frozen, these these go in nice. And also, if you're in a rocky area, these, you know, like a gravelly area or whatever, these go through the gravel and rocks a lot better. Um, so I'm going to give you four instead of two. Okay, so there's that. Um, did I drop my bag? Yep. So this is the second time I've had to do this video because the first time uh, my battery went dead. And when that happens, um, it gives you one option to recover the data. Well, when you hit that option, it's, it doesn't recover. I don't know why. So any clip that you were recording at the time, if your battery goes dead, you're going to lose it. There's nothing you can do about it. Um, yeah, that's something I think Sony needs to work on. This is a AX53, um, but I, I never understood why it, it gives you that option, but you don't get it back. You can cancel it, but you don't get it back. And if you hit OK, it executes. You don't. I, I don't get it. Um, it shouldn't wipe that out because your battery went dead. My other Sony don't do that. So yeah. So there's that. Like I said, let's go over this one more time and then I'll tell you how to enter this. Um, you want to get your hammock itself. This bag is built in. Once you, once you open this up and start taking it out, the bag is sewn right on to the hammock. So, yeah, right here. Sit sewn right there. And this is your bag. Again, it stays on there so that way you don't lose your bag for the hammock. So I did like that idea. 
So you're going to get your hammock. Now, like I said, I think it's 380 to 400 pounds or something like that. You're going to get your tarp. This is not the original tarp. It's identical to the original one, but it's not the one that came with it because the one that came with it kind of got burned up. All right, the whole thing didn't, but like one of the corners got burned up. So um, I had to buy another tarp, but it is from this company. It's the same exact tarp that came with it. Now, I don't know what this company name is. It's kind of like unbranded. Like I said, it was just a cheap hammock. Um, you know, it's not it's not real expensive guys but it's a good starter hammock i used it for a couple years and i've used hammocks for uh, many many times many many years i've used hammocks tents and okay so you're going to get an extra hank of paracord about three three and a half feet you're going to get your um you're going to get your other baggie that's going to have four instead of two um stakes in it your pegs and it's going to have three three not two um, guy lines in it because it's always good to have extra and you're going to get your your uh, your straps for your trees these are one inch straps I think they're 500 pounds so they are blue they are the originals that came with the tent so I don't know why they're blue but that's okay they're black and blue um, this is not missing a carabiner the other carabiner in fact this may be an extra carabiner if, if I if I remember right there's two carabiners on the hammock itself and then I believe this one uh, I believe this is an extra carabiner very strong I've never had an issue with it I weigh uh, 198 pounds I've never had an issue with these straps stretching or anything like that so yeah uh, let me see here yeah that's uh that's pretty much it now how are you gonna win it all right first of all I hate to do this but you know please be from the United States because I can't, you know I just it just I just wouldn't be I just can't afford to send this outside of the United States when we did the cash giveaway cards I would have sent those it wouldn't have cost as much this is not real heavy it's not it's very it's very light it's lighter than my new one um, but still you know to send this overseas or something or into Canada it would just be unfeasible so I'm sorry about that um, yeah, I just can't afford to do that I'm really sorry I wish I could give more of these out um, this is for my 7,000 subscriber um, in fact I got 7,001 subscribers so uh, which is it's kind of like a milestone um, I've been YouTubing for what 12 years I've got 7,000 subs oh well that's okay you know it's better than none so I'm giving this away since I got a new one um, there's no sense in me hoarding like you'll see guys the outdoor guys they got like 37 tents behind them and stuff start giving some of that stuff away because they're never going to use them all they usually take one or two well not take but they'll usually one use one or two of their favorites and that's it um, so uh, I like my new one um, you know it's it's uh, they call it a three-in-one so I can use it on the ground or up in the tree so if I hike in somewhere and there's no trees I can put it on the ground if the ground is unlevel but there's some trees I can hang so it's more versatile now this is very versatile very adjustable uh, the Arca says it's got a it's got a bug net you don't have to use it but it does come in handy down here in Florida because you know we get a lot of mosquitoes down here they're the size of hummingbirds <laughs> they can three or four of them can pick you up and carry you away if they want it so yeah we need bug nets down here and we got things like spiders not like spiders we have spiders and we have big spiders and I don't, I don't like that so I want a bug net okay so yeah um so that's what you're gonna get so please sorry but please be in the states I can't afford to but you know there's no sense of me keeping this because I probably won't use it again I mean if I have it I may get it out once a year and if someone else can get some use out of it you know twice a year <laughs> that'd be great but it, it'd be a, a, a great beginner hammock too for you know your youngins uh, learning how to camp or <coughs> excuse me or someone that just don't have the funds or the means 
you know I know it's very cheap but you know some some people just don't have the 30 bucks and they really want a hammock that they can go camping in here you go you know so hopefully this will help someone out um, so uh, yeah so I'm sorry about that please understand you know it's nothing against any other country or anything like that it's just I can't afford to send it out of the country there's just I just can't do that you know it's not that heavy but you know when you get it in a box and stuff they go not by only weight now they go by weight and size so it's you know so please understand that and also please subscribe um, I don't know if you're subscribed um, please subscribe because um, you know there's there's unfortunately there are trolls and there are people out there that all they do is is uh, just enter these enter ever you know that's all they do is spend the day just entering these different giveaways that's all they do and they win a whole bunch of stuff to keep for themselves or to resell for their own monetary gain and I really want somebody to get some use out of this because it's in it's in perfect condition um, like I said I, I don't think there's any holes in it I've never had it's never been set up around a fire um, but I know the last time I had it out I was out here, out back here in in the uh, in the hut that we're building. I set it up there, and it was you know it was fine. Um, it doesn't leak. It's in great condition. It's a couple years old, but it's in great condition. You you'll never be able to tell once you get this. When you win this, you'll uh, you'll go wow. You know it's it's in really good shape. And like I said, it's a great. It's not that hard to set up the. Uh, uh, the bug netting, you know, there are there are two ridge lines for the bug net. You know, what you do when when you hang your bug net, just make sure it's not too tight because if it's too tight and you go to get in it, it's going to rip. Okay, so you want that. You know, it'll look loose, but once you unzip it and get in it, then it'll you know it'll kind of stretch out and then you'll have plenty of room. Um, it's a great. It is. It's it's a great hammock. I like it a lot, but I like my other one better. Um, now it is a more expensive one. My other one was 116, I think. But you know, it took me a couple years to save up that money to be able to get it. And but in the meantime, I used this. Like I said, I've used it many, many times in a couple years, and I, and I I like to see someone else get some use out of. It. Like I said. Um, you know, you'll see guys, they're like showcasing all the stuff they got that 90% of it they're never going to use. They just, it's their collection. Um, I'm not collecting, I collect vintage video cameras, that's it. And they're not worth a lot of money, trust me. But, um, so I want to be able to give, give this to someone instead of me using it once a year, maybe you can use it twice a year. <laughs> Hopefully more but I want somebody to get some use out of it that, that maybe cannot so if, if you got like a whole bunch of these you know please please pass on this and, and give someone a chance that may not have one um, but I know there was a guy I was watching he he done a give he was doing he does a lot of giveaways he gives away good stuff tents and stuff like that and um, he's from the UK and he uh, he had uh, given away, I think it was a tent, and it was like a $150 tent, you know. Um, nothing special, but he wanted, you know, to help people out and give back to his community, and, you know, so he, he gave it, and he he got to looking on, on this guy's Facebook and started nibbing through his pictures on Facebook and found out this guy had $1,000 tents. He didn't even really need it, and he said, well, the way he put it was it was disheartening which it is you know just to to collect and and keep for yourself and you'll probably never use it you know I mean I know I probably wouldn't use a hundred fifty dollar tent if I had a thousand dollar tent so why you know why why have a bunch of, I, I can understand having maybe two different ones or you know something like that um, so you got more of a choice when you go out or if something happens excuse me if something happens to one I understand you want to back up uh, I thought about keeping this for a backup in case something happens to mine. But then again, but if it don't, this thing this is going to be sitting in my pack and I'm going to be packing around. It's not that heavy, but still, you know, 
you know, why take up any more room than you have to in your pack? Let's let someone get some use out of it. I've used it for a couple years. You know, it's time it's time for to, to share and let someone else, you know, be able to use it too. Um, so yeah, this like I said, this is for my 7,000 subscriber uh, giveaway. Um, so you're gonna get your tent, your your hammock, your um, tarp three to three and a half feet of extra paracord I'm thrown in um, you're going to get four stakes not two you're going to get four um, and you're going to get three um, guy lines they only give you two I'm giving you an extra one I had an extra one I'm gonna throw it in for you it's easy to lose stuff like that or you know if something happens if uh, you know it gets chewed in half by a beaver I don't know you have that extra one and you're gonna get your straps I believe this is an extra carabiner so yeah it's 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 a, it's a very good shape hopefully someone can get some use out of, out of it so all you're gonna have to do is please subscribe and uh, you can hit the hit the like button if you want but I would suggest turning on the bell too because this is going to happen. I'm I'm not going to do this live because it's just a you know it's just a thank you. It's nothing, no major milestone, but it's a small milestone for me. Um, so I am going to uh, film it. I will film it, but the winner will be chosen. I'm just going to do one of those automatic uh, winners. You know that picking thing. It'll pick, automatically pick a winner for me. Um, I will film it and I will upload that video March 20th, which is on a Monday at 8 p.m. That video will come out. So, you know, keep an eye out for that. If you don't hit the bell icon, just keep coming back and checking. But March 20th, um, please don't take like a week to get a hold of me. I'll give you, you know, two days. That should be plenty. If it doesn't, I will re give, I'll, I'll just do it again and give it to someone else. Um, so I've never had that happen yet but there will be across the screen of that video there will be a way you get a hold of me it'll be brunobear5000 at gmail.com that'll be across the <coughs> excuse me that'll be across the screen um, that's for my giveaways only so um, you know if you want to try to get a hold of me or something you know you, you can do that but it's best just to uh, um, it's best just to get a hold of me in the comments of one of my videos. Um, I get those more regular than emails, but um, I will be checking out those emails that night. And like I said, for the following two days after that, March 20th at 8 p.m., I will post a video of, you know, of the uh, giveaway, which will be announcement of the winner and then what you do when you get that if you win um send me something in the uh, in, in in my email you know and and i'll know who it is so don't just say hey i won okay so it's going to have to be you know i i need to know for sure you're the winner um but what you do okay then down at the bottom of this video in the description all you have to do is write hammock that's it you don't have to ask me how i'm doing you don't have to ask me you know what my favorite beer is or anything like that all you gotta do is write hammock when you do that i will give you a thumbs up and a heart that way you know you will be entered so that's all you got to do to enter um, subscribe and write hammock in the description of this video not the next one I know I had some people on, on the gift cards it was like on the fir on the first video that I did announcing that I was going to do the giveaway they was putting it down I was like no <laughs> or they was uh, no on the winning one they were doing it and I was like wait a minute that don't even make sense the winners already chosen and you're you know what I mean so on this video <laughs> down below in the comments just comment hammock that's all you have to do no big deal i would really like to see someone get this and get some use out of it especially you know like a, a you know a novice uh camper or something um maybe even a younger camper or someone who would be great would be uh you know doing, doing a youtube video when they receive it and 
trying it out for the first time so yeah it's it's like I said it's not hard to set up um, yeah it's it's pretty it's pretty cool uh, I love doing this and I just want to you know say you know just give a thank you you know for 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 watching and subscribing and so yeah yeah I like that so please just uh, be in the United States and uh, subscribe comment you know hammock that's all you have to do Monday the March 20th this month March 20th um, at 8 p.m. the winner will be announced so yeah so good luck to each and every one of you and again thanks for watching I appreciate it uh, so I think that's all I've got for you I believe that that's it um, <coughs> excuse me yeah I believe that's it that's good because I got a memory card Lincoln. Uh, yeah, <laughs> shooting a 4K, you know. So yeah, hopefully, you know, someone will get some couple years good use out of this thing like I did. I've really enjoyed it, and uh, it was a lot of fun. And now it's time for someone else to enjoy it and have some fun with it too. So yeah, guys. So I think that's pretty much it. So thanks for watching. Good luck to everyone. Appreciate it. Uh, all your support and uh, your comments. You know. Let's let's chat. Some of you guys get into a chat in, in some of my videos in the comments, and I really like that. I like when you get to talking amongst each other. You know, that's a community. That's when we're you know we're kind of like a family, and we have fun together. So remember Monday, the twentieth, okay, of this of of March this month, eight p.m. I will be announcing the winner. Uh, been in the United States. Um, subscribe comment hammock down below alright guys again thanks for watching I appreciate it Shea Bear the myth man legend <coughs> excuse me I'm gone for now stay tuned for more videos I know I haven't put uh, been doing a lot of videos I, I wrenched my back again and it usually takes me a couple weeks to get over that so um I was actually in a lot of pain when I made the last two videos of my my hammock, my new hammock. So that was that was rough. It was all right. And once I was once I was sleeping in the hammock, I was fine. But man, but uh, yeah. So uh, my back's been hurt for a couple weeks now. So, but it'll pass. It, it always does. So we'll see you guys in the next one. Good luck, everyone. Bye bye, and take care.